Hello, this is Mike Russell from MusicRadioCreative.com. I've had a comment on my YouTube channel from Old Time 30s asking Mike, many voiceovers I hear have some background noise, yet as soon as they finish speaking, it's silent. Is there a way to do this in audition? Uh, maybe a way to automatically silence quiet parts. Thanks again for the tutes. They're very helpful. Uh, well, Old Time 30s, I'm pleased to say, yep, there absolutely is. Now, you can do this on your DBX286S mic preamp and processor, which I reviewed in a previous video. It's got a wonderful expander gate feature. The gate is the bit that you'll need, and if you tweak the knobs correctly, you should be able to filter out any background noise before it even hits your door. But for this purpose, I've bought in a prop. Here we go. Ah! It's an air purifier, and it's rather loud because this studio is whisper quiet. So let's fire this baby up now. Let's get it going. Get a nice fan sound in the background, and I'll start recording a liner. Hello, this is Mike Russell. I hope you're well. Switch the air purifier off now, and let's top and tail that a little bit and play back the audio so you can hear the voiceover with a fan in the background. Hello, this is Mike Russell. I hope you're well. Okay, how would we get rid of that annoying fan noise? Well, it's quite simple. Effects, and then amplitude and compression, dynamics processing, and go for one of these presets, noise gate at 10 dB or noise gate at 20 dB, depending how aggressive you want to be with the gating. 10 dB is more aggressive than 20 dB, so let's go for that setting and play now. Hello, this is Mike Russell. I hope you're well. Now you'll notice the fan noise has completely disappeared, but there is a slight clipping on the start and end of some of my words that I'm saying. So I'm going to just uh, have a play with this point here. That's the point you'll want to move if you notice that yourself. So I'm going to move it up and across a little bit and it should eradicate that clipping, but hopefully still keep the noise fan out of the audio. Hello, this is Mike Russell. I hope you're well. And there you go, that's exactly how voiceovers can eradicate any fan or background noise in their recording. But remember, it's always best that you don't have the noise in the first place, so if you can get rid of a fan or switch off any computers that might be making a noise before you record, that is simply the best solution. The next solution is through your mic preamp and processor, and finally, if you need to do it in Adobe Audition, you've just seen how to do it. If this helped you, click like on this video now. I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com.